American labor leader Cesar Chavez once said, If you really want to make a friend, go to someone's house and eat with him. The people who give you their food give you their heart. And for more than 40 years, Andy Kreider has given his heart by sharing his food. Andy grew up in a household that valued education above all. His father, John, graduated from the University of Santa Clara in 1964. And it wasn't long before Andy became a second-generation Bronco on the Mission campus. During his three years living in Dunn Hall, Andy gained a reputation for serving home-cooked meals, using a rice cooker that student housing may or may not have known about. He prepared ramen, fried rice, boiled hot dogs, and other delicacies for friends and neighbors. After earning his undergraduate degree in 1974, Kreider was one of the first to enroll in Santa Clara's newly established JD MBA program. Although trained as an accountant, Andy took to law immediately. Accounting paints the world in black and white. Law shades the world with gray. And most importantly for Andy, puts service to others as its highest ideal. With Santa Clara degrees in hand, Kreider began his career as a tax partner at Arthur Young. In 1990, he joined Quantum as general counsel and vice president and in 2000 became Vice President, General Counsel, and Company Secretary for NetApp. In the early 1990s, Andy's wife, Giselle, introduced him to Rebuilding Together, a nonprofit helping low-income and elderly homeowners in Silicon Valley. Andy volunteered as a house captain for 25 years, raising money and assisting with construction. In all, he worked on nearly 50 homes, making vital electrical, plumbing, and structural improvements for residents whose homes were falling apart and who had nowhere else to turn. In 2008, Kreider helped raise $5 million to build the JW House at the Kaiser Permanente Santa Clara Medical Center. He spent six years on the board, including one term as president. Over the years, JW House has served more than 2,000 families by providing a close and comfortable place to live during extended hospital stays. Andy has supported the Junior League of Santa Clara, volunteered at Villa Montalvo Art Center, served on the Farrington Historical Foundation Board, and raised over $800,000 through the American Heart Association Walkathon. His father's commitment to education instilled in Andy a desire to pay it forward, which led him back to Santa Clara University. Kreider joined the Board of Fellows in 2011 and now serves on the law school's Board of Visitors. He was recently asked by Dean Lisa Kloppenberg to serve on the law school's inaugural executive committee. And through the years, he has been a guest lecturer in the International Corporate Taxation Course. But for Andy, the best way to give his heart is by sharing his food. So in 2008, he founded the Giving Gourmet, which donates fully staffed gourmet meals for nonprofit fundraising. The idea took root when Andy offered a multi-course dining experience as an auction item for the Juvenile Diabetes Research Foundation. He has since earned a degree from the French Culinary Institute, and cooked for the Sharks Foundation, Vita Blues Charity Golf Tournament, and a number of other local organizations focused on youth development and education. Kreider provides the food, wine, and service free of charge, so each nonprofit receives 100% of any donated funds. In all, those charities have raised more than $100,000 through Giving Gourmet, and Andy continues to cook for a cause several times a year. As it turns out, Andy's skills in the kitchen have come a long way since the days of rice cookers and boiled hot dogs in Dunn Hall. Whether it's swinging a hammer, teaching a class, or stirring a pot, Andy Kreider gives all of his energy, all of his talent, and all of his heart. For living generously, thoughtfully, and with service to others as his highest ideal, 
the Alumni Association is proud to present the 2017 Ignatian Award to Andy Kreider.